All right, like thank you for tuning the channel today. We're gonna set up the trailer TPMS on this new uh, Uconnect 5 system. Um, I tried to do it earlier and I had an error and I'm gonna show you where that error was. And then I didn't, I changed what I was doing and then it worked great. So um, let me flip this around and uh, let's get this trailer programmed. Okay, so the first thing you do is you get into your, uh, go to your vehicle settings and then you're gonna click trailer. And what I'll show you is when I first tried to set mine up, I did this on a few times and it wouldn't work. And I hit use this trailer and I hit tire pressure, set up all tires. And I've got two axles, four tires, I click next. Okay, so now it's giving me 50. So that's right. If you have some loan number in there that says like 400 and something, it's probably not gonna work. Try to select a different trailer. But we're gonna go ahead and do that on this one. Um, we're gonna put 80 PSI in for the trailer pressure. And then we're gonna hit start. Basically it says you're gonna drop each tire by five PSI. So I'm gonna hit start and the horn's gonna honk at me whenever it pairs that sensor. We're gonna to go to the next one and then back around to three and four. So let's get out of the truck and do that. Okay, so now we're waiting on it to pair this first tire right here. I'm just gonna pull the valve stem and he let about five PSI out. We got a horn. So we've got this one programmed. So now we're gonna move on to the next one. Number two, this is driver's side back. We got a horn. Like I said, it shows to move around the back of the RV. And then we come around here. This will be the passenger side back. This is gonna be your number three. And then we're on number four. Okay. So now we've got all that done. Let's go back around here to the get in the truck. Okay, and we get in the truck and we'll see we got four check marks right there. So we're gonna go ahead and hit finish. Okay, and then you look over here in your display, we can see all of our tire pressure settings. Um, I've got to air all those back up to 80, so let me get out and get that done. And then they should all clear out and we should be good to go. Okay, so I got all the tires aired up. And so you wanna set your threshold, let me focus on that. You know, if the sidewall says 80, you want to put it at 80 because it looks like there's about a 10 to 15% margin. See, like the 78 is not flagging, so it's probably got to get down to probably 65 before it flags at 80. So just make sure you figure that in whenever you put your number in. You can't change it. If you change it, you're going to have to start over and repair them again. So just, uh, I would just use the sidewall marking, put it in there and get close to it and then it'll, it'll tag off. So anyway like to thank you for watching the video on the Ram 3500 trailer TPMS setup. Uh, please hit the like down in the bottom corner and the subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos.